Hey, what's up everyone? It's Dr. Bob. In the new year of 2017, I'm going to start nerding out a little bit more than normal on you um, and actually showing you some studies that prove how amazingly effective chiropractic is. So this first one is the 2013 study from the Journal of Spine called the Early Predictors of Lumbar Spine Surgery After Occupational uh, Back Injury. So back injuries are the most prevalent occupational injury and the most costly health condition in the working population. They're devastating um, to the employees who just want to work and sometimes love their job and they can't, to employers that are trying to build their business and, and, and build it as big as they can. Uh, it can be very detrimental. So workers who first visit was to a chiropractor had significantly lower odds of surgery, only by 78%. So 42.7% of workers who first saw a surgeon had surgery within three years. Only 1.5% of workers who first saw a chiropractor had surgery in that same first three years. Uh, so it, it's basically a who you see is what you get kind of scenario. Um, they concluded that uh, seeing a chiropractor as the first provider for a back complaint significantly reduced the odds of surgery, roughly by 78%. So that we try to be the gatekeeper to a lot of injuries because if, number one, if that person comes in right away and doesn't procrastinate that the inflammation and swelling and adhesions from building, we have a better result at conservatively getting the pain gone and the problem gone even if it's a disc condition. Um, the longer you wait and then now it starts to build and it's devastating drastic pain, you end up seeing the surgeon, you're going to go that route. So when I ask you, if you know of anybody who is suffering, if anybody has an injury in, in, in this time of the year, anybody who has a car accident, um, have them come to see me right away. I get great results and I'd love to help them and never have that risk of surgery in their life so they can live a great life and stay on their job. Let me know. Thanks.